the Mysterons, sworn enemies of Earth. Possessing the ability to recreate an exact likeness of an object or person. But first, they must destroy. Leading the fight, one man fate has made indestructible. His name, Captain Scarlet. Patrol completed. Returning to cloud base. SIG. Rhapsody has just landed. Mm, we're off duty symphony. Oh, lead me to that room of sleep. Yeah, this four hours on, four hours off is sure tiring. Ah, where are melody and harmony? I guess they're still changing. <laughs> Hello, girls. What's the news? Hi, Rhapsody. Hello, Rhapsody. No news. Things are very quiet. Well, with Colonel White, Captain Blue, and Captain Scarlet away, I hope they stay quiet. I've a red indication. Angel One is not manned. All right, Lieutenant. They will be right there. SIG. Does anyone know where they've gone? Top security. Some special assignment, I guess. Smell that air. Wonderful. Well, we'd better move on. Oh, we're early. We can stay here a couple more minutes. Yeah, I guess you're right. It sure is a great spot. Ah, peace. The closeness of nature. No one for miles. Just listen to those birds. Buddy, we better get moving. Okay, okay. Pass me that rifle, will you? Hold it right there. I'm coming down. Don't try anything. 
back to reality. Yeah. You know, this is a private game reserve? Yes. My name is Panther, and this is Mr. Bear. I see. Now, where are you gentlemen heading? We hear they serve a fine lunch at the hunting lodge. Well, that's right. It's about a mile down the track, and uh, good hunting. Thank you. Mr. Lyon? No, thank you. I'll take another cup, waiter. Yes, sir. Good morning. Good morning, sir. My name's Tiger. Yes, sir. I understand I can get a good lunch at the hunting lodge. That's right, sir. You're expected. Good hunting. my sights, but then it's funny, I just couldn't bring myself to pull the trigger. I know what you mean, sir. That's why I had the camera fitted to my rifle. I enjoy my hunting even more now. And I can tell you, I get some great shots. Well, you can at least show the doubters a photo of the one that got away. Sounds as if another guest has arrived. Good morning, gentlemen. Hello, Tiger. Security post 14, SIG. 28 reporting, SIG. Security post 40, SIG. Security check complete, sir. Thank you. Well, gentlemen, shall we go down? Thank you, Captain Indigo. Take her up. Yes, sir. I think we're ready to begin. May I welcome you to the conference room of the Spectrum Intelligence Agency. Space General Peterson, Colonel White, Captain Scarlet, Captain Blue, 
We all know what the Mestrons are trying to do. Theirs is a war of revenge, a war of nerves against the Earth. Now, this conference has been called to try and assess our knowledge of the Mestrons and to demonstrate the latest devices developed for use against them. Dr. Giardello. Uh, thank you, World President. Uh, we at SIA have been working to piece together all available information on the Mistrons. Two obvious and important devices were needed. Uh, firstly, a Mistron detector, and secondly, a Mistron gun. Let us consider the gun first. Uh, gentlemen, if you'll gather around. By chance, we learned that the one thing which could kill a Mistron agent is high voltage electricity. This is their Achilles heel. And with this knowledge, the rest was relatively easy. The principle is simple. A beam of electrons are produced by the electrodes. These are concentrated by the prisms and projected at the speed of light along the reflective barrel. What sort of range does it have? We anticipate something like 50 yards. When will full-scale production begin? Immediately. Your men should have this equipment in a matter of weeks. That's great news. I can't wait to see it in action. Well, Colonel, I can give you a practical demonstration of the Mistron detector. Captain Indigo? Yes, sir. Bring down the C-38 detector. Yes, sir. I must do. As in the case of the gun, the principle of the detector was discovered by chance. Perhaps you will explain, Colonel White. Certainly. In the attempt on General Tiempo's life, we found that the Mistran agent, a Dr. Magnus, was impervious to X-ray. From this, Dr. Giardello has developed the detector. I'll bring it over here, Captain Indigo. Yes, sir. It's very simple to operate. Uh, if a couple of you gentlemen wouldn't mind standing in front of the screen. All right, Doctor. Shall we, Colonel? Of course, sir. Would you join them, Captain Scarlett? Certainly. Thank you, Captain. Now, let's say these are the suspects. First, Colonel White. We wait a second, then press this button and pull so. The X-rays have been able to penetrate, showing Colonel White is not a misteron. I'm relieved to hear it. What sort of range does this have, Doctor? Again, about 50 yards. My turn, eh, Doctor? Yes, sir. Thank you, World President. Again, we see an X-ray. The result is therefore negative. Now for Captain Scarlet. We all know the unique circumstances surrounding Captain Scarlet. He has retained some Mr. On characteristics, one of which is that he is impervious to X-ray. And so, you see a positive result. I think you've shown us a remarkable achievement, Doctor. Amazing. And it seems so easy to operate. It is, General. Here, try it for yourself. It's very light. Is a screen necessary? No, it will work anywhere, even in total darkness. <laughs> Uh, 
I, uh, I'll get back upstairs, sir. Well, Doctor, I congratulate you. You've done an excellent job. I'd like to endorse that. Thank you, gentlemen. Uh, can I help you, General? You just press here and pull. Colonel White, Captain Indigo is a Mr. On. Take care of him, Captain Scarlett. Yes, sir. Captain Blue. Sir. Alert security. This is a priority message. Code word ARC. Captain Indigo is in the hands of the Misterons. in a car. I'm going after him. Get out of there. The lodge is coming down. We can't use the elevator when the lift mechanism is in operation. You must stop it, Captain Scarlett. The master key is in the console behind the bar. I already looked. It wasn't there. He must have taken it with him. I'll get it back. Out. There isn't much time. It's coming down pretty fast. Where's the control console? About there. See if you can hit it, Captain Blue. Yes, sir. That's it. I'm out of shells. Well, at least you've slowed it down. It gives us an outside chance. Get him, and fast! I suggest we get under the table. What good will that do? They'll be crushed like matchwood. Try a couple of shots. Right. Look out. Try and get behind him. I'll draw his fire. And hurry, time is running out. We've only got a few minutes. Where's Scarlet and that key? He'll be here, sir. Come on out, Captain Indigo. Come and get me, Earth man. I've got him. Be 
careful. Don't go near him. It's all right, he's dead. I'll get the key. No. Hold it. Don't touch him. He's dead, I tell you. Stand back. <laughs> Don't get it. I was sure he was dead. This is the only gun that kills a Mr. On. Get that key. This is it, Colonel. He did it, Colonel. He did it. I think we've had a frightening, but uh, nonetheless very satisfactory day. We had hoped to see the two new anti-mysteron weapons, but in fact we've had a practical demonstration of them both. And they've proved their efficiency. I'll second that. Well, Colonel, I hear they serve a fine dinner in the hunting lodge uh, above us. How do you feel, Mr. Bear? Full, Mr. Panther. Full. By the way, Tiger, how was the duck? Excellent. It should be. I shot it myself this afternoon. But I thought you never went hunting. I used this. Look. Captain Scott. 